According to the acting director of the Department of Inland Revenue, Gaynell Roll, filing for the Commercial Entities Substance Reporting Act is critical. She said failure to do so can result in a $150,000 fine and an additional fine of $10,000 every month. Now, companies that use the entity identification number instead of the tax identification number must also register and report on or before January 31st. Well, For January those companies, limited companies, Bahamian limited companies, that have a tax identification number, and they use that tax identification number um, by which to access the portal and to file substance reporting. So the Department of Inland Revenue um, is responsible for assisting with the registration of entities that requires to report for um, commercial entity substance reporting. And to do just that, companies, individuals would log in if they have a TIN, uh, a tax identification number. They would log onto the portal using their username and password. Um, they would access the substance reporting tab once logging into the account, complete a visit of questions, about nine questions, and within three minutes, they would have completed that reporting that is required for the um, substance filing. We encourage all limited companies to register for the Commercial Entity Substance Filing Act on or before the 31st of January. January 31st is also the deadline for real property tax filing. Roll also announced upcoming plans for collecting real property tax. We began the project with the TILA operation where we had persons in doing a reassessment of real property tax throughout the capital here in the Bahamas. Um, we would have hoped that that project would have been completed by now. Um, however, that's going to be completed sometime this year where persons, the government is going to realize a greater revenue from real property tax. However, real property tax as assessed now has already been calculated and is out and we encourage persons that would have received those real property tax to come in and make payment. If you have not received your real property tax bill as yet, you can call into the office, you can log in online and be able to get a copy of that real property tax. Real property tax billing for the year 2021 is now available and due.